Gave it to O'Halloran. Green works his way past the couple. Pokes the pass and looking for and finding Toby Bedford. Game one. Hamstring pre-season. Otherwise, he would have been in for round one. We're in Tim Tarado's old number 14. And he slots it with ease. And the Giants are on the board. Braden Campbell short. And short again by Parker into the lap of Adams. They have away a couple of frees against the Cats last week that he'd love back. But he's given that plenty of air and got it there. Callahan again. He's had a lot of it. And he winds up and he can kick a long ball. Didn't get enough on it. Got it to the square. Green lurking. Scoops it. Daniels goes back. Perryman got it. That's huge. A lot of players in the league don't find Tom Papley very hittable. <laughs> he draws a lot of these types of free kicks. And Great inside pass. kick to Parker. He hasn't got the range in him. He doesn't believe. Hayward spills it. Mops up his mess. All part of his grand plan. Ash floats it to Buckley nicely. He's massaged it over the top to Callahan, who spills it. Danger now. Lloyd, did he get caught high? He contributed to it, but he did get it to the forward. And the last roll of the dice for the Swans here. Sits it up. McLean, brilliant! Luke Parker, who the boys are talking about at quarter time. Cornelio with the clearance. Bounces it inside, attacking 50. Hogan takes it back out. Perryman bumped on the kick. Not a bad spot to hit, though, and it was good last week. O'Halloran kicked three goals. Parker, knock. Warner got it from Rowbottom. Feeds it back inside to Lloyd. Has some time to spend it wisely and does so to McDonald, who can wind up and blast it. No one's in the square. Hayes doesn't get there. He's looking for a handball option. Speaking of academy products, he does give it off. Canelio, he gets away from Franklin, launches, and hurts them big time. Goulden picks their pocket. Laddams goes back to Lloyd, but it's a hurry kick, and it's wide. Angwin about to pounce. Robottom rides him. Angwin fishtailed him beautifully and chips the kick to O'Halloran. Speed kills. Xavier O'Halloran. X marks the spot. What? He's got two now. Kingsley, the stress ball, and John Longmire has Dean Cox. So we'll see how he goes in the next <laughs> couple of minutes. Laddams gets his own handball back. Straight down the spine. And that'll work. Franklin playing in front. Well, oh, just kick the goal. He's yeah. one of the best kicks in the league we've seen for the last decade. Kick the goal from 40. Himmelberg might. He just took it out of the air and spots up Cabman on the lead. And as well as Ryan Angwin, who's eligible. Parker extracts it. And goes long. Haywood! That's a huge grab with some hang time. Just pulls it central. Hoping for Franklin to get the lift. Did get up there, lads! And got it! And plays on and slams it through. Vintage Lance Franklin. To the pocket. Franklin met high up by set play on. Centering kick from Haywood. Golden! And McDonald <laughs> took the from his grasp. Brown coming. Got the bouncer inside, attacking 50. Callahan to Cornelio. Got himself free on his left. And he rolls that all the way home. Haywood tries to shrug. Squeezed a kick away. Goulden about to set this up again. He's got some space to use it wisely. Hits a good spot with the kick. McDonald's down there. Great hands. McLean comes at him. Pressurizes the kick. Himmelberg plucked it. Is he within range? Heads toward the square. Hogan wrapped up. Second grab. Got it anyway. Found Cornelio. 
Giants for the last roll for the quarter, perhaps. Hogan spills it. Daniels, the tiny dancer, dances inside and nails it. Sets it up. One last chance. McDonald hands on it. Papley. Papley pops up. Prime time Papley in the spot. Early momentum for the Swans if McDonald can take the mark and he can't. Haywood looks inside and he hits Clark brilliantly. Still lurking, Lance. He took a couple down. Tom Green, somehow to Kelly. A roller. And it rolls all the way home. The miracle goal for Parker. Out on the SCG for the first time in his first game. Kelly loops the handball over the top. Himmelberg in some space. Spends it to perfection. Play on, play on. Told to go. Heaney gets it back. Oh, a bullet. Oh. Sheather nearly <laughs> bounced off his chest. Big moment for him. Comes up to Warner. Warner without warning. Out of nowhere. It's like it's a go-to action now, and it's difficult for him to break that habit. Hogan squeezed the kick away. Caught was Perryman. Green, <laughs> something out of nothing from the superstar, Toby Green. Got him with the arm, wrap around, and, and almost gently dragged him to the ground. Good spot for a ball up, though, for the Giants. Pocket picked by Cornelio. Tried to kick it through the traffic, and somehow... Perryman squeezed it home, and it's a two-goal game. Certainly wasn't for Parker. Gets on the end of it, kicks it to the top of the 50. Haynes swooped on that and barrels it long. Race on. Perryman, Blakey, Blakey, Perryman. Three on two now. Bedford puts his head down. Green wobbles it and Great finds kick. Perryman. Beautiful kick. He's got two straight for the afternoon. Sets sail and cuts it back to a one-kick game. Five points to margin. 50 seconds and counting. Himmelberg takes out of the air. Did he throw it away? Did he drop it then? Toby Green. He bends it. Toby did he get enough on it? He did. The Green Machine has done it again. Back from the dead. Whitfield caught. Got her off just in time. The feed wide to Haynes. Down no. to eight seconds and counting. He barrels it away. Parker flies. Siren sounds. The big steal. They kick the last four goals of the game, the Giants. All games are equal, but some are a little more equal than others. And the 25th Battle of the Bridge won by the Giants.